lacing of a tent. The majority of the tents that are on the market today, you're going to see one large hole in the center for your center pole and then the smaller grommets to the right and left of it for the lace line. You need to line up the grommet side of the tent and the loop side of the tent so that you're starting in the middle of the tent. For the most part, all tents will start at the middle and work down, start at the middle and work down. Okay. The first thing you need to do is just flip the rain flaps out of the way. And then what you're going to do is you're going to line up the center pole position with the center pole position, right like that. Then you take the first loop, put it through the first grommet. Take the second loop, put it through the second grommet, and then through the first loop like that. And then you're going to pull it back toward you. The next, I'm just going to go right through this third one, and through this rope, and pull it back toward you. Okay? So go ahead and continue running that down. Did you catch it? We talked about uh, drop lace lines. I've been in this business for 30 years. I've seen a number of drop lace lines. What I've found, the problem with drop lace lines are twofold. Most of the time, it's because the guy that does it gets distracted. Okay? The guy that's doing the lace line, he might be the truck driver also. He gets called away to move the truck. So he stops where he is, he leaves, he comes back, he doesn't pick up exactly where he, st where he had started or where he had stopped. Uh, the person working across from him is continuing to go and as you know when you're lacing, you're constantly pulling on the vinyl. It may have dropped this lace out, he didn't see it, he picks it back up here and he skips one, you get the pucker inside or he just skips one completely and then you have a drop lace line. What we do, if for whatever reason, you have to leave this position, take this loop, attach this loop to one of the rain flap clips, right, like that, okay? Now, I can walk away from this and I can say, you know what, I gotta go move the truck. That is, would you get in there and finish for me? You know exactly where I stop. All you have to do is unsnap that snap and you know exactly where I stop. That will save you a considerable number of drop lace lines.